For this problem, we want to use transformations and the graph of f of x equals the square root of x to graph g of x equals the negative square root of negative x plus 5. g of x is equal to negative f of negative x minus 5. The negative function means that we will reflect the graph over the x-axis. So our new points are at 1, negative 1 and 4, negative 2. Connecting the points, we get the graph of negative f of x. The negative x means that we will reflect the new graph over the y-axis. So our new points are at negative 1, negative 1, and negative 4, negative 2. Connecting these points, we get the graph of negative f of negative x. Subtracting 5 from x means that we will shift the new graph to the right by 5 units. So our new points are at 1, negative 2, and 4, negative 1. Connecting these points, we get the graph of g of x, and this is the final answer.